What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all our jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Friday. Question mark. Today is Friday, April 23rd, and as I say each and every video, smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the cycles, just checking out the channel, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe and smash that thumbs up, smash that uh, notification bell, <laughs> the thumbs up button too the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out make sure you guys when you do put the notification bell make sure you select all videos because I put out live streams and all kinds of stuff out like that too but if you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video be sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT how to spell that will be in the hashtag below the video and in the description box below um, first things first, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which if you've been looking at the map, she's right up here. Amber, Amber, Amberino? Always called it Amber, Ambernadino. I don't know why I added these and stuff, but <laughs> right here, she's right here, right under the word window rock. She will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know, or not of America. Um, how I get to her when she's in this area is I fast travel to Valentine, right here, and you should spawn somewhere around this area, well, up here. Uh, I'll take this route up here. Once I get to this little fork right here, I go directly across through the woods into this dotted line, this first dotted line. When I get here, I just follow the path down and around to her location. Simple as that. I feel like it's not too much of a problem. If you do have the camp or the wilderness camp where you can fast travel, getting out of there is easy too. Just open up your wilderness camp and fast travel out of there. If you wanna go back to Valentine, go back to Valentine. If you want to go wherever else, just go. But that's how I get to her when she's in this location. I don't move any camps or anything like that because I feel like it's kind of pointless for this area. I feel like the only time you need it is down here. But anyway, let's get to the next thing, which is the Caribbean rum for today. The Caribbean rum is right back in this tent right here. I don't know if this was the same tent that it was in yesterday. I cannot remember. I think it may be the day before, but right here at this location, that's where you will find your Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle. And right here inside this tent, at the back of the tent, that's where you will find it. <laughs> I feel like I said that like three times. All right, let's go over here. To where we normally do business I'll try to get in real close for you guys so you guys can see each and everything that I did uh, mark so you guys can go get it the cycles for today Friday April 23rd are family heirloom cycle 4 all luxury cycle 5 coin cycle 5 arrowhead cycle 6 wildflower cycle 4 antique alcohol bottle cycle 4 all tear card cycle four, bird egg cycle four, and fossil cycle four. I'm gonna have to double and triple check that. So I don't know if I'll be doing a live stream, but I will be going through. So check the description box below to make sure the words that I say are match the words, I mean the numbers down bottom. The numbers that I tell you guys, the cycles that I say in the actual video, if you actually watch the video. Make sure down in the description box below that the, the numbers that I tell you guys match the numbers down bottom. But 
let's get to the things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. Uh, there was one up here that I want to tell you guys about, which is it's a coin. It's right up here. Right underneath this triangle right here. You see this triangle in the map right here? Right under that, there's a clothesline. And right in the middle of that clothesline, come over here with your metal detector and you will get a random coin. Let's go down a little bit to this location right here. Right there. I'm gonna zoom in for you guys so you can see exactly where it is. Right between that line in the, the map and the coastline, you will get a random fossil. So come over here with your metal detector again, and that's what you will get. Let's go over to the right, right here by the word McKay, right inside this L-shaped uh, shack, right here at the back, right there exactly where my marker is, you guys will get a goat hairbrush. This goat hairbrush is sitting inside the shack on a bench, right here at this location where my marker is. So go get that. Let's go over to the left a little bit more. There's a couple things, well, two things really over here. There's, matter of fact, right here before you go over there, right here at this house, you will find a tarot card. That tarot card is a eight of cups on the porch of this house. Uh, right here next to this square, you will find another coin. Come over here with, with your metal detector. And that's what you will get. Uh, one more thing over here while you're over here, if you're over here, right here at this location, you will find a random lost jury. So come right there. And that's what you will find. Uh, let's go down a little bit to the little trigger part. That looks like a trigger to me. Uh, right here inside the house, one thing. There's two things. The first thing is in, inside the house. On your right hand side on the table with all the candles and stuff, you will find a King of Swords tarot card. And right here behind the house, right there, this is right behind the square right there, you will find a random lost jury. Another random lost jury. Let's go down a little bit to our next marker, which is another fossil. Once again, come over here with your metal detector. And that's what you will get a random fossil. Let's go back over to the right and right here at this location, make your way here. And right there where that marker is, you will get a bird egg, which is a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's in a tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Only a rifle, I mean, no rifles, only a varmint rifle or a bow don't use a high power rifle like a boat action or something like a Smith Smithfield, that's what you call it, or a, a Car Carcano. Don't use none of those. Use a varmint rifle or a bow with a small game arrow. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's go over. Matter of fact, inside this mansion right here on the piano, you will find it's another tarot card, which is a three of pentacles. Let's go to our next marker which is underneath this bridge right here. Go underneath the bridge with your metal detector and you will get a random, another random coin uh, with your metal detector, remember that. Uh, let's go over here to the cemetery before we go down, right here at this location, right inside the fellow's grave building. <coughs> you will find a rule pearl necklace right here at this location. Let's go down a little bit. Let's go here first. Right here at this marker, you will find a tarot card, which is a four of cups. This four of cups is sitting on a box near a fountain with a light. So the fountain with a light is like right here. That's just to make sure you guys are in the right area. But right here at this location, that's where you will find the tarot card. Let's go over to our next marker. Let's go down here first. Right here at this location, you will find a ivory hairpin. This is right across the street from the saloon. 
in there's like a brick wall right here with a little gate go through the gate there's a table on that table you will find your family heirloom which is a ivory hairpin right here at our next marker which is right across the way right around the corner right here inside a little side cabinet um i guess somebody threw it out i don't know but right here at this location you will find a Abello Ruby Bangle Bracelet. <laughs> I have to slow that down because I cannot say it five times fast. Right here at this location, you gotta open up the, the little door and then position yourself again in front of the cabinet and you will be prompt to grab the Abello Ruby Bangle Bracelet out the cabinet. Let's go down here to our next marker, which is a antique alcohol bottle. How you get this antique alcohol bottle is go through the gate. Uh, there's a platform here. To your right, there's a path that looks like it leads into the building, but the path leads down underground and around to this bottle. Grab the bottle off the crate and reverse. The antique alcohol, alcohol bottle that's at this location is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. So make sure you grab that. Our next marker is a cardinal flower. And this cardinal flower helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for today. Um, let's see what else we have for you guys. Um, inside this house, inside the Braithwaite house, there is a jade hairpin on top of the fireplace. Second floor, first room to the left. There's also a tarot card, I mean a, a coin down here, right outside of this stranger's house. I don't think I ever talked to this guy, so that's why it don't show up. But right here outside, there's a big tree. Right by that big tree is where you will find your random coin. If you guys want to go get that. Uh, I have a couple more things. Inside roads, there's pretty much not really anything to talk about. There's a couple tarot cards. There's a tarot card right here, which is a six of cups. And there's a tarot card right inside this little room. And that's a nine of pentacles. There's also a random uh, lost jury right Outside this house, like right here, there's an outhouse right in front of the outhouse. Come over here with your metal detector, and that's what you will get, a random lost jury. Two more things. One is inside this house right here. And inside this house, you guys will find a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush. This New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush is in a chest in a bedroom. And the last thing I have for you guys is... This marker right here, right at this marker, come over here with your metal detector and you will get a random arrowhead. Um, that's pretty much all I can give you. There's a stump right here. So it's right by the, the tree stump that's right here at this location. We'll try to put everything back and frame. The cycles for today, Friday, April 23rd, once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Terra Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossil Cycle 4. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Terra Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and fossil cycle four. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for liking. Thank you guys for commenting and sharing and all that other good stuff. I appreciate each and every bit of it and I try to say it as much as I can. As I say each and every video, remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out because I put out videos each and every day. It's your main man, Hitman. Once again, and I'm out.